Still pictures of the Rwan president Buhari slaughtered on Salah. Kid claims Disney owns him 100 million US dollars. Oda, who killed superior officer, explain why he did. What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, it's your boy Dilo Fish and I'm back with another new video. Please, I want to say something before I get into the information I want to share with you guys. If you are new to my YouTube channel and you want to keep seeing more of this video, please, don't show love by kindly clicking on that red subscribe button right now. And don't forget to tap on the notification button so you get notified every time I upload another video. And please, if you have anything you want to say to me, just leave a comment in the comment section about your thoughts and opinion. Or you just follow me on my Instagram, Pijelo Official. DM me, I'm always online, I'm going to reply you. May God continue to bless you as you do so. Stay tuned. Before I start this video, let me be saying Happy Salad Day to all the Muslims out there. So I'm going to be showing the pictures of the Brown President Muhammad Buhari slaughtered on Salad Day in Abuja. Moreover, the man identified as Muhammad Buhari is the present and current President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, if you don't know. Religious Eid Isala is a single day during a year which Muslims are permitted to slaughter a ram and celebrate with family and friends. However, ram slaughtering is one of the most important things to do as a Muslim on this blessed day. It is normally done by those who have the chance and opportunity because it is not compulsory in Islam. Furthermore, it was early shared on his Twitter page. Here is the screenshot. He tweeted, I observed the Eid il Kabi prayer at home with my family this morning in keeping with the adversary from the presidential tax force on covid 19 and the nigeria supreme council for islamic affair once again i wish us all safe and happy ed hashtag ed mubarak according to the writer as the muslim all over the globe celebrates this beautiful day may god almighty accept their prayers amen Moving on to the next discussion of the day, Nandra singer Yodeji Brian Balogun, known professionally as Whiskey, has claimed that Disney owes him a whopping of 100 million US dollars. He made the claim amidst the release of Black is King on Disney Plus. Earlier today, Beyonce teased the video for Brown Skin Girl, the best award winning song featuring Whiskey, sent JHN and Blue Eevee. On November 11, 2019, news broke that Nigeria Superstar and Beyoncé had started shooting the music video for fan favorite brand Skin Girl. Shooting commenced on October 31, 2019, though we could not verify if the claim were true or Whiskey was simply joking on Twitter at the time of filling this report. On Instagram, Beyoncé shared that the film is meant to celebrate the breadth and beauty of black accessories and acknowledged that its release takes on new significance in the current climate. Speaking to Twitter not quite long, Whiskey stated that Disney owns him a whopping of 100 million US dollars. He wrote, Good day to wake up, Disney owes me 100 million US dollars. Good day to wake up, Disney owes me 100 million US dollars. Whiskey at Whiskey Ayo, July 31, 2020. Guys, what do you have your mind about this? For me, I was shocked when I saw it. Like, what is really going on between Disney and Whiskey? How did that app 100 million US dollars? That's not a small amount of money. That's a very huge amount of money. Just make sure you don't forget to click on that red subscribe button. So, when I get more information about it, I will let you guys know. Guys, moving on to the last news I have for you today. Show that we killed superior officer explain why he did. The show that was responsible for the death of another show that named B.S. Ngogi recently came out to explain why he did what he did. B.S. Ngogi was on the phone receiving a call from his wife when he was attacked by the killer from behind. He was reportedly shot by the soldier. The killer apparently served alongside his victim in 202 Battalion of 21 Special Armored Brigade Bama, Bono State. The shoulder said that the reason he killed the superior officer is because he refused to grant him a travel pass. He apparently went AWOL, which means away without official leave, for six months and his bank account was frozen by authorities as a result of his actions. And when he returned to the base, he asked for permission to leave in order to resolve the issue with his frozen bank account, but his request was denied. This rang the soldier and he decided to take the superior's officer life, which he eventually did. The killer is in the custody according to the acting director, Ahmed Public Relations, Kumusa Saji, and he will be punished for the horrible crime 
he committed. Shoja, who was killed, reportedly got married last year. Please, if you made it to this point of this video and you're watching it right now, can you go to the comment section and comment RIP, rest in perfect peace. May God continue to bless you as you do so. Please, make sure you do that. RIP to him. So guys, this is the end of the video. Don't forget, if you are new to my YouTube channel and you want to keep seeing more of this kind of video, make sure you kindly and lovely click on that red subscribe button right now. And don't forget to tap on the notification button so you get notified time I upload another video. And please, what I want to say at this end is that Happy Salah to all the Muslims in the whole world, in the whole wide world. Happy Salah, make sure you stay safe because the coronavirus is still out there. Please always wear your marks anytime you are going out. Please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section about your thought and opinion. Or you follow me on my Instagram page, Official. DM me, I'm always online. I'm going to reply you. And please don't forget to click on that red subscribe button. Stay safe and stay tuned to my next video. And don't forget you can also share with friends. See you in my next video.